more beer, more reviews. Checking in with Six Point. Woo! Mm, I'm excited. I'm hot. I'm sweaty. I'm about to drink some resin at 9.1 alcohol by volume. Damn. 9.1 is a lot. 130 IBU. It's going to be bitter. It's only 12 fluid ounces, unfortunately. Uh, I would like more, but I have more cans, so I'm going to finish those after we film this. So, resin 6 point, uh, not green point, Red Hook. Red Hook, Brooklyn, New York. Longtime favorite. I got on the Bengali because of them. Got me into the IPAs, got me into the double IPAs. This is a double, I believe. Resin, beers culture, year round, year round, year round. All right, here we go. IIPA, so it's an Indian Indian pale ale, so double IPA, let's go. I remember our first sip of hoppy beer. Do you? Yes. It was Bengali at a bar on 55th Street in Manhattan. I was like, hmm, this is good. And then I just kept having it from then. Nearly spit that shit out. No, I didn't actually. I actually enjoyed it. Sours though. Definitely spit that shit out. I was like, wasn't expecting that. Random high school story. I was choking outside of high school one day and I was like, uh, uh, water, water, right? So my boy hands me a Poland Spring bottle of water. It wasn't Poland Spring, guys. It was filled with vodka. Whatever I ate that got stuck in my throat flew out. Flew out. Funny story, but no, I did not spit my double IPA out or my IPA out the first time I had it. Bursting with juice, ripe as hell, makes you look forward to that first resin all day long. Can't wait. We do it at sunset because we got to work during the day. You know, we got a lot of stuff to do. Got a lot of jerky to send out to people that order jerky. We're an e commerce business, we sell merch. We're just like fun people. We do shit during the day. You know, we adventure. That's what this brand is all about adventure, living life to the fullest. All right, 9.1. I'm excited. I'm nervous. I'm, I'm going to drink it. I'm going to sit on my couch after this and relax been a good day. Woo! Smoking right there. It's filled with juice. You ever like open a Welch's grape juice and smell it or orange juice and smell it? Like, boom, it hits you right in the nostrils. This is what these IPAs do. They're good. They're packed with juices and deliciousness. Look at that color. Dark dark for an IPA that's a dark IPA I love the head on it you got a little smoke in there too which is nice like gives a little like structure a little mm, layer of taste you know crisp smooth easy it's a double so it's gonna be on my sleeping on the floor tonight. My wife's gonna kill me, but it's good. It's clear. There's a little smoke in it, which I'm digging right now. I'm definitely gonna be hurting because this is not a summertime IPA. This is like perfect fall, winter, crisp, smoky. Let me not say smoky. It's not really smoky. It has a the bitterness scale is 103, right? Yeah, 103 on the bitterness scale. That's what I'm tasting. That's giving that like earthy aftertaste right down there, but it's good. I'm enjoying it. Like that bitter, bitter beer that you just want and enjoy. And you know what I'm saying? Like, that. Ah, uh. crisp, it's smooth, it's delicious, it's everything you want in a beer if you're ready for a strong beer. If you're summertime in it and you want light, smooth, like, obviously nobody wants that Corona right now, but if you want that light beer, this is not it. If you want that 
hearty, good, delicious, like, it's your meal beer. Resin. Bengali is my number one. Love you guys for making it. Love you guys for putting me on to beer. There's so much. Mm. Keep drinking it. Keep being responsible, though. Alright? And... Might as well have it with some pineapple jerky. Let's go. Till next time.